Hello, welcome to the Water Cube here in Stockholm this year. Would you mind beginning by introducing yourself and showing us your name badge? Uh, no problem at all. My name is Mohammed Abdul Nashiru. Uh, as you can see here, yeah. hmm? Abdul Nashiru. Thank you. And you work for Water Aid? I work for Water Aid in the West Africa region. Is this your first time at World Water Week? No, my third time. Your tenth time? Third. Third time, yes. okay. Wonderful. Welcome back. Thank you. Uh, and you are a representative from Liberia. And recently there has been a, um, a new project that's been promoted called Water and Sanitation for All. Uh, what are Liberia's plans and goals um, in relation to that? Uh, excellent. Uh, I think uh, Liberia, as you're already aware, is just emerging from war. They're trying to move from, uh, mm -hmm. I mean, transitioning from uh, humanitarian and so on to development, which is fantastic. And there couldn't have been a better opportunity than the Sanitation Water for All initiative, which looks at flexible partnerships for uh, deepening national level planning. Uh, mechanisms mm -hmm. and bringing uh, donors to align with those national systems. So um, the government of uh, Liberia is really, really very strong for sanitation water for all. The president has given it uh, her blessing and she's the one who is actually championing uh, water sanitation in Africa. That sounds Presently, wonderful. Yes, the compact, they have prepared a compact which outlines four key priority areas and the president is pushing for those areas to be Great. And what are those four key priority areas do you have? Uh, one is on uh, data management, which mm -hmm. is monitoring evaluation. The second one is on service provision, mm -hmm. and there's a strong emphasis on equity, mm -hmm. which is uh, fantastic. And then the last one is on institutional development. So they are presently uh, revising the various institutions to ensure there is harmony mm -hmm. and donors align. That's wonderful to hear about. And what other issues from Liberia are you bringing to this Water Week this year? Uh, particularly the role of civil society organizations. Civil society organizations are well organized in Liberia. The media, those dedicated to WASH, they are organized, organized to the point that they are able to hold government accountable. And WASH, can you um, expand a little bit on that, on what that stands for? Uh, uh, which one exactly? WASH. WASH. Uh, water, and sanitation and hygiene. Okay. So there are civil society networks that are focused on water, sanitation and hygiene. And they are working with the media to hold government accountable to some of its commitments. Great. Thank you so much for taking some time to share with us today. It's good to meet you. Pleasure.